that seems really like a trick. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the, the wall to help you. Okay. So walk right up to the wall. Pick which leg you want to. Try not to get twisted around the other aids on. He is better to one direction than the other. I think he's better going the way I just did. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, he struggles with the other way, but we'll work on it. And put one leg back and just turn back to your parallel to the rail. Keep working on it. And if he gets a little frustrated, we'll walk away for a second and then go back. Yeah. So I'm walking him up to the wall, stopping, and then doing the leg? Yes. I mean, you don't really have to stop him. You can get around the wall. Yeah. Yeah, so we're using that to your advantage. So the one thing you have to do when you go to put the leg on is he's going to either, he might try to avoid by turning his head. So just catch him with your rein. <coughs> if he does that, try to let him turn, but don't hold him here if he's not trying to turn. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if I can get back to it's a lot. It's a lot of just brain power. Like yeah. Making your aids independent. We talked about that before. Yeah. And I really brought everything, everyone back to basics. Not that they don't know what they're doing, but yeah. like just a different way to think about it. I think you get a lot. I know. He's like, I know this. Yeah. And then back, like, in yeah. the stirrup. Yeah. I take I take my foot in the stirrup sometimes if I feel I'm not getting anything. And you're gonna keep the pressure on until he moves. So that pressure might be a single squeeze. Mm -hmm. It might be a bugging bang, 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 bang. Uh, like there he's trying to avoid. Yep. So catch him with your right ring. Good. There, there, there. Okay, one more. Apple. Uh, and just go back to it. What you don't want to do is yeah. get the pressure on. Take the pressure off, but he's not doing what you want. Yeah. So. Even right here, as far as your leg. Okay. Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. I just let him think for a second, and then I'll ask him again. Because he's a baby, and yeah. he's not exactly the smartest. <laughs> and not that he's stupid, but he just doesn't learn really fast. Like some of them, you do it twice, and they like get it. With the warm bloods. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> Give him a second. He's gonna pull it into there. It's okay. And then half halt. And then bang it with your leg, your right leg. Until he steps over, yep. Yep. Go ahead, bend him right. Sorry? Bend him right. With the rein? Yep. Because he was trying to go, okay. he was trying to take that left shoulder over, right? Yeah. Okay? So bend and his your right leg again, yep. Okay. There. Yeah. Yep. And what he's going to do now, because he just did this twice, is he's going to try and turn that way. So you'll have to keep him on the right rein. Keep him so that he doesn't get to move the rest of his body. Okay? There, give him three back. So it's probably a little bit more rein. Just because we, when I asked you to pull that, he was already leaving. Yeah. yeah that's all. Okay, but you still get the response. Yeah. So let him think, and then just walk away, and then come back face on and come the other way. You're even making me think tonight. <laughs> it's been a long day. <laughs> it's okay. Just bear with me. <laughs> I'm not flustered in the... There. That's right, right? Yep. I mean, that was pretty good. Mm. We'll go back again. So go out and then come back yep. again. Try not to turn him before you move. Right, because you want the aid to be simple. It only be the leg. Okay, we'll use the rein if he's trying to avoid doing what we want to do. I'm glad that my training got stuck. <laughs> I must have rode here around here for 25 minutes with those storms. <laughs> At the drop. And I put my stirrups back in, uh, my feet back in the stirrups, and felt like I was riding in like an air ride bus or something, like something super fucking yeah. nice. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, so much better than that sitting drop. Was that okay? Because it seemed like he turned his head first. Uh, it wasn't by, that was a little bit you in the rain. Yeah. Try and ask softly with that leg first, and then okay. if you don't get a response, give him a dirt. Okay. okay. Let's try again. Yep. It's, the only way you're going to get better is if you...
Ideally, I'd like him not to move his head, but first, I would like you to be able to do it without needing the rein. Does that make sense at all? Um, and that is that he needed to move his head. Yeah. <laughs> well. But that was lovely. <laughs> yeah, seemed good. Yeah. Here's your okay. sponsor. We'll go back one in and then we'll go the other way. So you'll want to use your right leg this time to meet it once you get there. And what's this used for? Like dressage or? Uh, flying changes. Okay. Um, so there you go straight. So you can push them back over off your left leg to get them straight if you want. Yeah. Good. Too much. That's okay. Push them back off. Give them a little half hop and then push them off your right leg. Okay. Don't bend the rein. Like there. Bumper cars. See, everything is reliant on our reins so much, right? Yeah, that's how beginners are tired, right? I know. Alright. I'm going to break you guys of all that terrible habit. I fault. Keep the pressure on though until he steps out right and be annoying. Okay. He wants to move it because he's got it picked up. He just hasn't figured out where yet. There. Okay. So, and what's most important, Chris, is, is that you are consistent with that message every time because, or else we're untraining him. Mm -hmm. Right? So that was really good. He's like, oh my God. <laughs> I'm dying for this. I know. <laughs> All right, I'm going to walk over there. Around yeah, well, I'll try that one again. <laughs> <laughs> James, you've already pooped once in here. Don't you know that? <laughs> God, like <a> cow patty. <laughs> it's as big as a baby cow. Holy crap, James. <laughs> Literally. Yep, so can you keep the pressure on? That's good. Yeah, but yeah. Just walk it's okay, half halt. Don't let him walk. Here, we lean back with your shoulders. Yep. There, okay, bigger half halt. Until he stops walking, close your left leg. Yep. Keep bugging him harder and harder, harder on your reins. There! <laughs> yes, yes, no, that was right, because that hind end stepped over, right? Yeah. And that's what you were asking. And that's good that you stuck with it because now, because what he said is, I don't want to do this fucking shit anymore. Right? <laughs> so like, we're going to do it again. Yeah. Like, this lady already rode me for an hour yesterday and did this <laughs> shit. Like, I'm annoyed. <laughs> but if you had said, okay, don't worry about it, James, it would yeah. have been harder for you to do again. Yeah. Stick with it. There you go. Good. Are you going to take that or are you going to go one more step? I'm going to go one more step. Okay. <laughs> I just forgot. No, it's okay. That was good. And half hop. Good. And then you can pet him. He was a good boy. That was good. And he didn't freak out when, you know, when you asked for a little bit more. He was, he went. So I don't want him to freak. Okay. So the next exercise is, which I'm actually quite happy with that. Yay. Can you remember it? And you, and you follow through with my stuff, yeah. right? Because it's great that I can get on and ride them. But if then everybody doesn't follow through, then it's really pointless yeah. for me to get on and ride them. Sit ways each time. I guess it don't always go for up the left leg. It's really easy here. 